what up um this is my first video in a while um and this is basically a pc slash tech slash gaming brands tier list um first of all we have amazon basics i mean like you're probably gonna pay less than um ten dollars for like a mouse here or like five dollars for a mouse pad um if you're buying like cables like hdmi cables like this is like the perfect brand because it's reliable but at the same time it's cheap um amd i mean to be honest uh s tier like you know they make cpus better than intel they make gpus that can rival um nvidia at a pretty affordable price point and plus they they're competing in two big markets making like everything better value for everybody so that's good I mean, Apple, I, I'm saying not good. They're not trash trash. They're not really meant for gaming anyways. But, you know, I mean, like, their iPads are really good. Um, especially, like, the processors on their iPads and iPhones. But, yeah, I mean, for, like, MacBooks and stuff, it's not really meant for gaming. Asus, I'm gonna put in, like, good or... Yeah, I'm gonna put in good. I mean, fuck. I mean, the only experience I have with Asus is, like, their Chromebooks. <laughs> um alienware i'm gonna say it's decent i mean i haven't really had any alienware like the only all like the alienware products i found are pretty expensive um dell for gaming <laughs> um I i'm gonna say not good um i haven't found like a dell product that's really you know meant for gaming but I mean, their products are reliable and like last a long time. So Gigabyte, I, I'm not even sure like where to put this. Um, I'm gonna say decent. Uh, me personally, I didn't have that much experience with Gigabyte. Um, Google, I, I mean, it's a pretty good tech brand. I mean, for gaming, not really. I, like they're not like that big into gaming, but Google's like, you know, YouTube, Google itself, you know, just like without google like what are we <laughs> um hp um they make i i think they um, have this omen line and they make pretty good um gaming laptops huawei um like their value is really good i mean i'm not sure about you know the security of, and like stuff like that um but you know their value itself is pretty good and based on that alone i'm just gonna put it in good um intel i'm gonna say like I, yeah they're decent like i mean right now like amd is dominating but like intel like their processors for like even laptops are still like dominating in that area so yeah they're doing pretty good lg i mean lg has like so many things kind of like samsung like they have you know refrigerators um high-tech uh, tvs um i think they used to do phones and not anymore like samsung like it's s tier because like they have everything they have like phones um laptops um refrigerators wash washing machines <laughs> um logitech i'm gonna say it's good really good keyboards i mean like their gaming ho um, hardware when it comes to like gaming accessories is top tier uh microsoft i mean what they they own windows like there's nothing else to say um nintendo s tier really innovated um in console development um you know driving force of video games especially like before the 2000s nvidia i'm gonna have to put in s tier i mean the best as well they have the biggest uh, gpu market share i believe but I, I would still put amd over nvidia i'm not sure what this is uh, i don't want to say trash because i don't i don't know razor i'm gonna say good i feel like they kind of overpriced their items because like after two three weeks like their their items are already on sale so like i guess i mean they have good marketing and stuff but um overall it's a pretty good um accessory brand sony i'm gonna have to put good or i'm gonna have to put the best to be honest i mean it's a great tech brand um 
you know, PS4, PS5, um, really good consoles. Um, Corsair, I'm gonna have to put it to decent. Um, they're not as innovative as Logitech or Razer, but um, they do make great products and also like inside the PC building space, they also make some products there which are okay. HyperX, I'm gonna have to, it's not, yeah, I was, it's pretty decent, like, um, the one thing that they're kind of known for are headsets, but other than that, it's okay. Um, MSI, I'm gonna say it's, I'm gonna say it's decent as well. I have, like, um, two or three pieces for my PC that, um, are made by MSI. Um, pretty good price point, you know, it's pretty average for their competition. Steel series, yeah, it's good. I, I mean, I, yeah, it's pretty decent. Cause, like, they have like the most popular mouse pad, but like, other mouse pads are probably better. Um, they're not that innovative in mice as well. And other than those two things, Steel Series is just um, not that branched out outside of those. And of course, Wish, we're gonna have to put it in S tier. I mean, like. Great place to build PCs, um, great place to find, you know, expensive laptops, um, yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, thanks for watching, um, it's been six months, but yeah, still.